Shining, shining like a diamond. I see, I see people watching. Perfect, our glass timing. Good things come to those who wait. Silhouette looking cinematic. Yeah, I bet that you. If you like tech and stuff, then do check out our new channel, Technomera. Link on the screen and description box below. Okay, so it kind of goes something like this. Take a clip and put it in the timeline. As you can see that it is a clip of a guy recording himself. Now go to the effects tab into the utility section and you will see this face or filter. To apply the filter, you can either put it above the clip, kind of like this, or you can put it on the clip to apply it. For me, I will apply it above the clip. Now, you will notice that our face in the video is blurred. And if you play the video, then you can see that the blur is tracking the head here too. Okay, so if you double click on the filter, then you will see these other faces to apply instead of the blur effect. Well, it's cool that Filmora has included these. But you know what? If you want, you can also apply your own face instead of these faces. As you can see that it is also tracking my face perfectly too. Okay, so now there is no direct option to apply your own images or faces in Filmora to blur other faces, but I know of a way. If you guys want to learn how to apply your faces here, then let me know in the comment section below and I will make a video of how I applied my face here. Okay, so this is how you blur faces in Filmora or apply another face on someone else's face in Filmora. But you know what, there is some condition that need to be met to do this. In this video, you can see that our subject is standing still. So, what will happen if I use another video? Let's take this one. Let me render it a bit. Okay, so here you can see that Filmora is trying its best to blur the face. But, due to heavy motion in the video because the person is dancing, it is having a hard time tracking the face. So yeah, to blur the face this way in Filmora, your video should be steady or with minimal movements. It should not be of a person dancing. That's what I want to say. But you know what? Here is another video of a steady person. And he is completely steady and not moving at all. But guess what? Filmora is not applying blur to its face. If you wonder why, well that is because this guy is looking at the side and also his face is not well lit. So yeah, your video face should not look in the side. And your face should also be well lit to apply the blur on it. But you know what, here is another case. This time it is still not blurring the face. Even if the video is in motion but the center is looking in the front. You can see that even though the face is well lit but according to Filmora, it is not. So what will happen if I take the side guy clip and increase the brightness? You can see that it is still not doing the job. Well, what if I make his face big by cropping the video down a bit? Hmm. You can see that the Filmora is now at least trying something. Well, not good, but at least it's trying. So yeah guys, basically to use this face blur feature of Filmora, there needs to be some condition mapped. You need to have a well lit video with a straight face or a little bit of side but not too much of the side and the subject should be front facing with less motion on the video so that Filmora can able to track it and put it on the face and also don't complain that why bother if it has so much conditions well Filmora is exactly not that advanced yet and also even softwares like Adobe, After Effects and Premiere Pro has a hard time tracking the faces so if Filmora can able to do it this much then it is already amazing so yeah guys, that is how we blur faces in Filmora properly. And again, if you want to know how to put your face on the subject, then let me know about it in the comment section down below. And if you think that this video is worthwhile, then hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that I can able to bring amazing videos just like this for you. Till then, see you later.